<laughs> that one scared me. Oh, shit. Hello. Ha. Top of the morning, friends and family. Welcome to the vlog, you wonderful, beautiful people. I'm here with my nephew, Chase. You may have met him briefly on the last video Hi. when we did the, the snake yoga. If you missed the snake yoga, I highly recommend you go check it out because we've... I think it was pretty good for the first time ever doing snake yoga, but we're out here at one of my favorite places to come and try and find rattlesnakes. Not gonna guarantee we're gonna find one, but you can never guarantee that. Chase, what do you think? I think I'll find one, maybe my lucky day. I'm pretty lucky. Might hey. be able to catch one. He's feeling lucky. There's our first one. Oh, don't let it bite you. Oh, okay. All right, let's go. I'm thinking somewhere in the bushes, as long as those ladies up there don't scare them off. What'd you see? Lizards, there's two really huge ones, like in these bushes. I'm gonna walk back this way for a couple reasons. There's a bunch of people over there. Yeah. And I don't, they're probably scaring off any kind of wildlife. So we'll go, we'll go this way. I'm the first to turn. I got distracted by that stick. That's why we didn't go this way. <laughs> yeah, if you hear a buzzing noise, it's a good sign. crazy thing about this place is that it's usually kind of cooler, especially it's October right now, but it's already 80 degrees and it's the morning time. So that could either be good or bad for us. Well, let's check out this area. Hopefully you hear the rattle before you feel the bite. I don't think I really have any business going to this area trying to find a rattlesnake. This is we came in here last time with my friend Haley, who worked with the Pearl Lab. And we're actually gonna see Haley, I believe, coming up real quick here in the video, is gonna be out there at the Reptarium. She's gonna come meet us up one of the days out there and get to catch up with her and find out about, about what new rattlesnake research she's doing currently. So that'll be, that'll be cool for us. What do you think so far, Chase? You feeling skunked or how are you feeling about it? Yeah, I'm still feeling pretty confident. Might take some patience. The iconic bridge, my favorite landmark. <laughs> I was too slow. Next time, pretty fast. Next time, I'll just use my hand. I have a lot of better luck with my hand. Oh, dang it! <laughs> oh, yes, yes, yes. Where? What are you not smart? There you go. Oh, exactly. <laughs> Dude, we're gonna get super like don't move. Don't move. Stay right where you are. No. This is even better than a blue belly. What is that? It's an alligator lizard. All right, so we definitely didn't get skunked. Got ourselves a nice looking alligator lizard here who's maybe thinking about taking a bite of me, but I'm trying to stay pretty mellow with him, so he may not bite me either. Um, got a little bit of poop on my finger. <laughs> Thank you, sir, for that. <laughs> um, he's chill though. Look at the size of his head compared to his body. He's got a nice big chunky head. Oh, oh, he's trying to swim away. Don't bite me. Don't bite me. We're chill. We're good. All right. I was like, we'll at least find you guys Scalopris, but hey, alligator lizard, we'll take it. I really don't think you're allowed to fly a drone around here, but man, I would sure love to. See, Chase kind of went out on his own. Let's see what he's up to. Had a bee on my hand. Whoa, this is badger trail. Any luck, dude? No. Nothing? But this is badger trail. Badger trail? Hmm. Here we go. Let's go. It's gone. I don't know, do you think we'll see any 
badgers on this trail? Maybe. I like the optimism. Because we never bring any water. Oh, we didn't bring water, you're right. Oh. You know what? That's a common theme when I come out here on these hikes. I came out here with Eli a couple months back and I, I didn't bring any water then either. All right, we didn't skunk out completely. We got the alligator lizard. You're still feeling pretty lucky? Yep, I am. I really still want to find a snake today. Yes, so what we're going to do, we're going to go road cruising the night and try and find some either baby rattlers or goats for snakes or both or king snakes, something, some kind of snake. Anything. Worst case scenario, we don't find anything on the road. You still get to feed some big retics, some rabbits. Yes. 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 Had to take a little pit stop on our way to Herpin. Check this out though. This view is fantastic. So Chase and I have been out here road cruising for like a good while. How long? Is it? 30 the minutes maybe? Yeah, it's, it's cold. It's not as, as warm. It's Apparently it's too hot during the day for, uh, too hot for snakes during the day, but too cold at night. It's not nearly mm -hmm. hot enough out here. By, by the time we got to this road, we'd already found five snakes when I was out here with Dave. So one benefit is Chase doesn't really get to see stars down there in the city where he lives. So yeah. this is the first time like seeing all these stars like this, huh? It's pretty yeah, badass. Yeah, since I was in Hawaii, I never saw any of these. Yeah, so, hey, didn't find any snakes out here, but we did find yeah. stars, and Stuff. we're still going to go feed big snakes, so. Mm -hmm. Daytime herping, all of a sudden nighttime herping, all of a sudden it's time to feed snakes, but you ready for this one? Yes, I am. I'm definitely ready. All right. Whoa. Whoa, she got that one. That one scared me. <laughs> Junior's got an insane fever in his body. Yeah, I can tell. <laughs> that was a little scary. He <laughs> came flying right out. I did not think it would do something like that. It missed it at first. I know. I got and then it just came out of nowhere. Oh, shit. Jesus Christ. Okay, wiggle in front of his face. Wiggle in front of her face. What? Oh, get her attention with the rat. She's focused on me, dude. I don't want her to bite me! She's not gonna bite you. Dude, put the rat in front of her face. Put the rat in front of her face. Come on, she's gonna bite my camera. Or bite my hand. Get in front of her face, dude. There you go. <laughs> there she got it. Oh, man. You. That was epic. No hesitation. Yep. Good. Oh, we need more. Good job. Whew. That was nice. Now you ready to feed the big ones? Yes, I am. Pretty, pretty little afraid, but. Pretty little afraid. A little bit. That's good. I, I want you to be. I want you to be careful. 
Fourteen oh, foot hey, snakes. I want you to listen to me okay. and do exactly what I tell you to do, okay? Okay. Come on, how far back? How far back? <laughs> big snakes take big muscles. Yeah. <laughs> Head to face. Get it up there. Caught herself too. That's the cool part about it. Which one of them weighs the most? Uh, Pets, for sure. Petsy? <laughs> Rabbit juice. Huh? Look at that. Ah! I'm washing my hands. I'm gonna do better rabbit juice.